Hey, hey, friends. Happy October. Hope you guys are having a great day. We ooh, are going to be doing a big project today. We're going to do a whole entire scene. It's probably going to take us a little bit to get this project done, but I got to get the project done because psst, it's my art project for our couture tour tonight. So um, come on in, say hey. I see I finally connected to Facebook. I should be connected to YouTube. We'll find out. When you come in, let me know. Uh, my engagement question today is, it's National Vodka Day. Tell me what you like to um, um, mix your... Uh, whoa, like shush, that? Siri. What you like to mix your vodka with? For those of you that drink vodka, I'm not saying you have to drink vodka, but for those of you that drink vodka. Um, so come on in. We got a lot to get started on. I am going to jump right on into this um, because, like I said, we got a lot going on here today. We are going to be doing some primitive pieces in with um, this project. Um, hey, Wendy, how are you? Uh, I'm going to try and pull up my phone here to see if I can seek... Um, all the things. Um, I also wanted to quick share this into my VIP group. So we're going to do that really fast. Um, so let me get this pulled up. And um, how was everybody's this? I know it's Wednesday. I was not live the last two days because I have my BCFF here. Um, so she has just, hi, Kat. Hey, Deb. How are you? Hey, Lise. Just, just, just. I fell down the farmhouse rabbit hole. Dear Jesus. Oh, Lisa. Hi, Connie. How are you guys? Um, join me for a huge primitive Christmas scene. I will post the link, the cart link, obviously, as always, once this is all done. Um, and we will go from there, guys. Uh, so there's that. Okay, so we're posted. We've got, woo, we don't need my volume on. Um, there's that. Oh, hi, there she is. There's Tanya. She's here. She's live with me, you guys. Hi, Mary Beth. Um, so she might peek her face on over here if she feels up to it. Well, you're not going to see her, though, because, well, you're only seeing my hands right now. Hi, Mary. How are you? All right. So, like I said, we're going to be doing a huge scene. We're going to be doing some stuff with that awesome um, canvas that we created um, to smell so, so good. I am making, hi, Star, um, the projects you can do, right? Oh, my gosh, Lisa, it's awesome. Hey, Jen Morton, how have you been, girl? A long time no see. All right, so we are going to jump right on in. I am going to get started. Um, a few of these things we're going to paint. Um not everything, just a few things here um, because they're going to be gorgeous. So I'm going to get the painting started. Um, we're going to be using cherry. This is like, I wish, I wish, I wish. Hey, Rebecca, um, I wish my color of the month, you guys, which if you have not seen it yet, it is called Napa. Um, I wish my color of the month Napa was in because honestly, that was the color I wanted to paint with. Womp womp. It is not in stock. Uh, I mean, I'm sorry. It's not at my house. It's not. It is in stock. It's in stock. It is not at my house yet. It has not landed. So, but I have to get my project done because Couture Tour is tonight. So we're jumping into this. You can go into my online store right now. Get your orders in. Um, I will have the cart link for this, but if you want to just jump on over right now and get started. Hey, Jane. Hey, Carolyn. Um, you can do it. Hey, Lori. Uh, you can do that, uh, by just going right to my link. Um, I'll have it posted. I'll pop it into the link down, um, into the comments down below, or you could just look right here, uh, chalkcouture.com backslash Jessica. Um, because hi, Jen. Hi, Jenny. How are you doing, girl? Long time no see. You can grab your Napa right here. Just please be sure to go to my online store, guys, with the issue from last month. Um, I am uh, from August rather. I still am not getting all of you guys back to my online store. You may have been cookied to another designer store. So please join my online store again, okay? If you were my customer. Hi, Cheryl. Because I miss you guys, okay? Um, so here we go. So here's, let's get at it. Let's go ahead and let's get started. We're going to paint our, um, what is the name of this surface called? I forget. I forget words all the time now. Um... I'm drawing a blank on the name of my surface here, guys. Uh, here we go. Let's go to my book. Let's go to my handy dandy um, um, uh, little product reference guide here and see what the name of my surface is because I forget it. Burp, 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 burp. 
forget. As soon as you say it, I know I'm, I'm going to be like, oh, I yeah. know. Oh, flip sign. Duh. Oh, couture boutique see? flip sign. Um, so we are going to do our couture boutique flip sign. And we are going to paint the one side cherry. And we're going to be doing a portion of the reindeer games on here. Now, I'm going to be doing three different signs. Like I said, this is going to be a whole scene. Typically, you guys... I would be doing this in probably a few days worth of a project, but you're going to want to stick with me. Go get yourself a, um, a drink and stick along, come along for the ride because we're going to be doing um, a few projects in one here today, okay? Um, because we got lots to do. Like I said, I have Couture Tour tonight. So if any de um, any designers are on here going to Couture Tour, let me know in Philly tonight so that way I can say hey to you. Um, let's see. Um, hey, Janet, how are you? Is there a new release tomorrow? There is, Ginny. We're going to have... Um, oh, please tell me I sent that picture over. Darn it! I will add it. Um, I was going to post it. it. It's scheduled to post on my page, I think, at 4 o'clock p.m. Eastern time today. We are going to have the Nativity. Um, we're going to have the Nativity um, Chalk Made Kit post, you guys. It is gorgeous. Um, let me show you a picture of it. I'll show it on my phone. Um, I do have that. I could have sworn I put it up onto the, into my switcher, but of course I forgot. Um, I put all the other pictures up. Here it is. So this is the nativity set. Okay. Whoopsie. Hold on. Let's find out where it's got to go. That is our nativity set. You guys look how gorgeous that is. That is going to be available tomorrow. It will come with 11 wood cutouts, two D-sized transfers, a jar of gold chalk paste, and adhesive stickers for the star, along with that wood box from the Nativity. It will be released at 9 a.m. Mountain Time tomorrow, you guys. 9 a.m. Mountain Time tomorrow. So um, I'm super pumped about it. That is going to be such a gorgeous addition to anybody um, who knows the nativity story. It will be beautiful under your tree. That's where we put our nativity. Um, we put that under our tree. I can't wait to see. I'm going to see it in person tonight at Couture Tour. So I'm super pumped. I will maybe even go live with it to show you guys. And there is some fun transfers that are going to be coming out. One specifically that I have been begging for. So I am going to tell you, I will be, we get to create with some, um, un, uh, non-release transfers. Um, and I am super, super excited um, to go ahead and create with them, um, specifically one in general. I'll give you guys a hint. If you remember our old build a cocktail transfer, this one is very similar. And it's just in time for National Vodka Day. I am so excited. It's going to be perfect in my dining room at my BART area. Um, I'm just so pumped about it. I have big ideas, big plans for it, actually. Okay, look how pretty this cherry color is. You guys see this? Um, I can't wait. I need to ship it to my daughter in case it doesn't make it in on time. Oh, that's a smart That's a smart decision, Kat. Kat, make sure you uh, contact uh, corporate. That oh, yeah, you have to let them know. That's right. You have to let them know that you're shipping else. it someplace else. And the reason behind it. I hope cherry becomes a color. permanent color. Permanent. Heck yeah. I think that that's like the a best real red. red. Yeah. The... I love cherry. I love it so much more over candy apple. Oh, same. So much more. I'm being a little messy on my sign here, you guys. I'm sorry. I really wish I wasn't, but I'm trying to do it for time, time, time. Uh, what is it called? Guys, I don't have words. This is Adderall for you. Uh, Adderall and Vyvanse, it's a thing. You just lose your words. Well, then what's my excuse? Um, oh, old age. Old age. Oh, yeah, <laughs> old age, because you're so so old. We're so close in age, friend. Okay, so we're going to dry this really quick. Actually, you know what? I'm going to let it dry on its own because I've got other things to draw, other things to paint. And I'm going to just put it right over here. Hopefully, Eddie Boy doesn't step on it because that would be super sad if he does. He's laying over here. <laughs> oh, he's a baby's. Okay, so we are going to paint. Um, hi, Dawn. How are you? Isn't this red so pretty, Carolyn? All right, good, cat. Good deal. We're going to be getting two. Okay, if I could get this open. We're going to be doing two of our... Oh, my gosh, you guys. I can't get it open. Um, Chalkable Shapes, the Reindeer Games. Okay. We're going to paint them. Um, 
here's one. And once we paint it, we're gonna be doing something else with these, okay? We are going to use it. And actually, you know what? Before we paint the one, I am gonna use it because we're gonna trace it onto our, um, wait, is this the way it goes? Hey, Jenny. Who is that? My daughter was, oh, hi, Jenny. Uh, my daughter was on Adderall. She's off it now. Yes, Kat, I'm back on that currently until uh -huh, until my Vyvanse comes back in stock, which I know the company that makes it has that my dosage in stock again. It's just a matter of getting it to my CVS, which is taking forever because I got the text message from the company saying, yes, your dosage that you have been following is back in stock, blah, blah, blah. But it's like, oh my goodness. I just want it to be here. I want it to be available now. Now on these ones, I'm not gonna go as heavy handed with the color because I kind of want to distress them a little bit. So that paper? No, no, I'm gonna um oof. I'm gonna do some um probably some uh, feather weathering on oh, them. Okay. It's kind of the thought process my brain's going with at this moment. Oh, okay. But it could change as we're going. It could totally change as we're going along, you know. I just go where my brain takes me. That's what I've, I've learned to do these days. I go where my brain wants me to go, and I'm trying to consider, the reason why I'm doing the red is because I'm trying to think of all my other Christmas decor gotcha. and what, how I'm going to do my, this is going to be part of my entryway, I think. I'm not 100% sure because I kind of am still going with the Nutcracker theme, but I think this might be fun to go with it if I can pull Cat, off the yes, idea that I have. Cat, yes, you can get multi-packs of the deer. Yes, you can. I, this is why I have these ones. Um, they literally just came last night, and that's why I had to wait to get my project going because I was waiting for more deer to come from the release. Okay. Generic of your medicine now? Of Vivance? Yeah. Um, That's what somebody just said. What is the one that they make the generic of? Sandy, what's the generic of Vivance? I was not aware of that, I don't think. Okay, now here's the other thing we're going to do. We are going to, oh shoot, we're going to paint three spools. I'm trying to think, should I do the spools red or gold? And then do the sticks red or keep the sticks natural? What do you guys think? Should I do my spools gold? No, spools red. I thought red and sticks, sticks gold. gold. That's what I was going to do. Okay. So we're going to paint my my spools in the cherry as well. And you know what I'm going to see about? I am going to take, I'm going to show you something that we're going to do that's going to make them look super pretty, I think. Hopefully at least. Um, we're going to take some chalk paste and not water it down. And I'm going to get a, a board eraser and we're going to come in and lightly bore, um, come over it with some shimmer gold and we're going to add a little shimmer gold to it. Why? The, sh the On the cherry? No, no, this. Why? That was, um, that's my, uh, that was a um, couturier gift. That was a couturier night no, gift. I know that, but it's like. I know. I'm short, so I won't walk into it, so it's okay. She's pointing out things that I have hanging up. I have like, you know, <laughs> gifts from Couturier Nights. Hey, and hey, Susan. Stuff like that. Who's that, Susan Tapley? Yeah. Oh, hi, Leanne Parker. You got the snowflakes last order. Nice, cat. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, this is such a pretty color, you guys. Cat, the shimmer. Oi. What? Shimmer white. The shimmer. Shimmer frost. Shimmer frost is gorgeous on the snowflakes. Yeah, I was going to actually consider adding some shimmer copper into my cherry because I think this that would have probably made this, but I can't do it yet because I have to, I didn't want to do, uh, I have to paint the other reindeer and I can't do it until I trace it. Sorry, my brain's going all over the place, you guys. You would think I didn't take my medicine today, but I promise I did. It just doesn't work so well. It's just not working well today at all. Oh, look how pretty this cherry is. I'm telling you. 
It's such a pretty color. You have a unique project in mind. Ooh, I can't wait to see it, Kat. Hey, hold on, you guys. I'm trying hard to not make the world's biggest mess, but you know, what fun would that be then, right? What fun would that be? I hope this turns out the way I want See, because I that for um, Jess. She can look it up later. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Sandy. Thank I appreciate that. Sandy really, you have no idea how much I appreciate it. Seriously. You are a godsend for telling me that because Vivance was the only thing that literally I could get at least six to seven hours of like the best brain function ever with my Vivance. It just works so well. Adderall just doesn't work for me. Plus, it like Vivance really helps my my anxiety. Um, Adderall's not doing its job. Like I'm way more on edge, and I can't handle it. I hate it. I hate the way I feel. Okay, do I have everything painted that I wanted? Oh no no no! Now it's time to come back and do second layers of some things. But we got to dry it first. Okay. Um, hold on. I got to uh, clear off the table because I don't want my stuff on the bottom here to get ruined because this is a flip sign, which means it's double sided, you guys. So we don't want to mess that up, right? Plus, I've also got candy, um, not candy apple, cherry all over my fingers. And I literally just got my nails done. So, you know, way to ruin your manicure already, Jess. <laughs> Rude. Didn't take long. Rude. I think I got it. I just hate when it like, cause it's a red and it like sometimes yeah. can dye your fingernails, but it didn't. It didn't. Okay. Let's get this off though. That way we can keep on going. Like I said, I just don't want my backside dyed here. Okay. Okie dokie. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, boop, boop. Get that little reindeer out of the way. We got to do a second coat on him. All right, let's get this second coat going. We gotta dry it because it's still wet in some spots. Hey, Danielle Evans, how are you doing? The cool thing about chalk painting with chalk paste, you guys, is it dries lightning quick. But it also means you've got to work quickly with it. Um, like as well when you're painting with it, like you have to be careful because you can also relift your color back up, which is something you don't really want to do. You know, you don't want to lift that color up. You just want to have, oh, look how beautiful that is. I love it. And of course I'm using our brush from the artist tool set. Trying super hard to not have any streaks. It's a little easier to see um, on the camera if it looks streaky. But then it doesn't because it's deceiving. Because the camera makes it look like there's streaks. But then there isn't when I look at it in person. <sighs> so silly. Seriously loving it. Oh, I love you too. Oh, you were talking about that. Oh, I was talking about the <laughs> color. But I do love you too. <laughs> of course. Okay. It looks pretty good. Mm -hmm. Make sure I get all of my streaks up. Oops, I just flung flung it onto the wood, but that's okay. All right, so we're gonna put this to the side, allow it to dry. Oh, don't flip on me. Gosh, it's so pretty. Okay, I gotta remember to not turn around and step on that. All right, this guy already dried. So we're just gonna come in and repaint over him really quickly. 
and then we'll do our own distressing to him. thick again so we're going to add just a little bit more water to our cherry here I just have to be able to have enough left to do one more reindeer So he is good. Now let's come back in. Let's see if we have to touch up our spools. Just kind of one more time. And then we're also going to paint just the top of them. I don't care about the bottom, to be honest with you, you guys. smarter of me to paint the top first before I go in for the second coat on the side so I can actually, you know, touch it. Okay. What? Oh, Connie's comment. Got your nails done again. Oh, yes, I did. Me and Tanya went. Tanya cheated me to get her nails done even though I was going to do that. She's a goof. Oi, hold on. Oh my gosh, I'm trying to like get these done. Hold on. Guys, I'm like literally the world's messiest crafter, I think. <laughs> AKA Messy Jesse. I know, seriously. Oopsie. That was a little thick there. Don't forget it. I'm just going to grab something. Why? You can't get it open? You just pull it up, you know? No, it's not I a can, twist. But, but there's too many I like in there. Oh. I'm like, forget it. I'll just buy some. I was going to say, there's only four of the same, the four of the same one in there, you know? It's not many. It oh, may just, it? I think it's only four. Okay. I think. Look at it again. Okay. Okay. That's too much so let's around. see. Hold on. Let's see if this. Hey, Anita. Did I say hi? Hi, Mary Ellen. Actually, I know how we're going to distress this up. I have the best idea ever. Mm, 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 mm. Hold tight, my friends. Okay. All right, I'm going to be honest with you. There, This side is actually a better looking side. The other side is a little too raw. Like, I know it's, guys, sorry. If there's something to be said about that. Okay, we'll keep that like that. All right, now let me get my a 
Okay, ouch, let's move on and let's get um, the part that I need to um, Um, let's get, oopsie, hold on. Let's get our, why can't I find our live? There it is, okay. Oh, what happened to the live? Where's my live? I lost my live. I was trying to have it up to look at the people coming in. There it is, okay. Um, here it is. Um, let's get now our one piece. So since everything is dry, I can at least move it over to the side. Oop, except for this, hold on. So there's that one. Let's get, this is pretty dry. Um, let's get my one. I'm going to put these, I'll put this like this. Okay, now, where's this? We got to clean this off because I don't want to have any of this be picked up on the bottom of my stiff. We are going to go ahead and we are going to trace one. And we're also going to do a little something. So I'm going to trace it. However, I'm going to cut it a little bigger than what I traced, you guys, okay? Who is he talking to up there? Okay, there it goes. Okay, so, hi Amy, hey Peggy, how are you? Okay, ready? So let's go and do, where is, here it is. Okay, so you guys hopefully saw the live of me showing you how I dyed um, and grunged up my fabric, okay? So what I'm actually going to do is, oh, what are you doing? I'm going to, oh, it doesn't even really matter which side I do this on, to be honest with you. All right, so where is that guy? Here he is. So I'm going to go ahead and I am going to trace him. And I wish I had a pencil. Do I not have a pencil? I do not have a pencil. So we're just going to use a pen. No big deal. It's okay. So I'm going to, because it's going to be, you know what we're going to do? We're going to do the inside out because this is now gonna be the inside out. Okay, so I'm going to go a little bit bigger, you guys, because I need to take into consideration stuffing and cutting, okay? So I'm just gonna guesstimate. Okay, that's not gonna work. We need a different marker. Let's do my, mar let's do um, a shimmer silver. Oh, actually. I mean, let's do my gold chalk marker. This should work. Okay. Yep, it does. I'm just going to go outside. I'm leaving a little bit of room okay to do in the trace here so that way I have room to cut and have more room to stuff does that make sense you guys you we're all following along here right uh -huh. hi Connie hey Barbara hey Denise how are you guys? And I'm trying my best here to do this without moving him. And this is where it may get a little bit tricky. So he's got very detailed antlers here, which is awesome. 
Don't get me wrong. However, because of how detailed it is, it's making it a little bit difficult for me to see what I'm doing. When you stuff it, you're going to need a craft stick to help with stuffing. A craft stick? In order to help stuff into the antlers. Oh, yeah. I usually use the one, um, our one piece. Um, what's that thing right there? I can't think. Detail tool. Oh, yes. Okay. And that is, I did go a little too wide based on the other pieces. Okay. So now we've got our, can you see it? Oh, you guys may not be able to see it, but I promise you it's here. I'll hold it up in just a second and show you, okay? All right, hold on, let's get this cover back up. Now I can go ahead and paint him. So let's put this back to the side and let's get this painted. Oh, so this way this can dry. That really hurt. I stepped on a cord. <sighs> and I'm barefoot, so you know. Okay, so let's get my paint going. This is the last thing I have to paint. It's the last guy. Okay, that's mine. Yep. Thank y'all. <clears throat> thank you, thank y'all. Go ahead and get him painted. Obviously, we'll do a second layer on him. Am I doing him the right way? Hold on. Yeah, that's the right way, right? Yep, that's the right way. Okay, I just had to make sure of that. Really quickly. Go ahead, let the hem dry. Mm -hmm. Oh, you got home from work? Nice, Connie. You see it faintly. Okay, awesome. Hey, Tracy, how are you? Hey, hey, Tracy. Hey, Janine, how are you? Hey, Margie. She said, hey, Tanya Han. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's get our second coat on our little friend here. Ooh, I love the way this looks. Again, I just made it a little too thin, so I had to thicken it up a little bit with some of the watered down color. Once we have everything painted, the rest is going to be super fun. I promise. Like I said, this is going to be a little bit of a longer alive because, guys, I'm doing an entire scene. These are things I would typically spread out over a few days to show you. 
But time is of the essence because we're leaving in like, what, three hours? Yeah. Yeah, you know. What time are we leaving? Four o'clock. Yeah, three. Yeah. Three hours. Leave. So, you know, we're going to leave to go meet up with the folks, with my team. And then we have Couture Tour at 6.30. Okay. Oh, gosh. Okay. All righty. So we got that. <gasps> Hi, Margie. Hi, Lila. How are you? Are we going to see you tonight at Couture Tour? Or are you and Ted on a big, excellent adventure? <laughs> they did there. I know. They um, travel. They travel oh, all gosh. over. All right, so we are going to have our reindeers, reindeer, not deers, I swear I graduated. Okay, perfection. Hey, Debbie Green. Guys, wait till you see how amazing this turns out. You're going to love it. We are going to love it. Hey, Carolyn. What's that? No. Hey, Natalie. How are you? I cannot hear anything you just said. I'm so sorry. So sorry. I could not hear you. My not able to attend tonight, helping out with our brand new. Oh, congrats. Congrats on laces, Lila. That's awesome. Congrats. 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 Oh, shoot. Hold on, you guys. I got a goopy amount of uh, color in between the ears. And you know what? I don't mind. Oh, gosh, there's a lot on the edges, too. No, I don't mind if it's on because you know why, guys? That sh that makes it more, like, grungy. Like, no, if it's Tracy, on. That's not Napa. That is. This uh, is cherry. That's cherry. Yeah. Napa's going to be a little bit more on the purple side. Think of wine. Yes. Think of a wine color. A burgundy. Yeah. Mm. Wine I do wish it was here in time. That was my hope that I would be using that for this, that but that's okay. Awesome. It's okay. This is still going to turn out exactly as I wanted. Okay. I'm just, I'm forcing some distressing of the, uh, not all the areas, just some. Okay. So there's that one. Come in and get some forced distressing here on the edges, some chunks of the cherry. I did a better job of painting this one, but now I have no choice but to come in. And like I said, you'll see how I plan to distress this. What is that a reminder of? Stop. Okay. Buy lottery tickets. <laughs> I know. Huge. Huge, huge, huge lottery right now. Okay, you guys. I think we have forced enough distressing. So this is looking good. I'm playing with all your chuckable shapes over here. Oh, you can do all you, anything you want. That's fine. <laughs> Okie dokie. I think we're good. I think I did enough. I said, we don't want it to be perfect. Okay. So here is that with our cherry. What did I, I was going to say, what did I do with the lid? My poor cherry needs to close now. Let's get you mixed back up. Make sure you're nice and creamy, dreamy. And you are. Let me get you back into your home here. 
And now we're gonna get some, we're not gonna do our shimmer gold to paint with. I'm gonna use a different gold, like an actual gold paint, you guys. Um, your ship today, nice cat. Hi, Andrea. Um, excited to for you all tonight. I recall a fabulous event last time we were all together. Yes, totally, totally, totally. Okay, let's see. All righty, let's put this guy to the side. Let's put this guy to the side. These guys are both off here. We're gonna clean this up and we're gonna pull over our gold paint and we're gonna paint our sticks. And then we're gonna get started on our fabric. Um, deer. Actually, you know what, let's get all our chalking done and then we'll do our fabric deer. We'll save that guy for last, okay? That way we can kick out a bunch of projects because you're gonna see how quick and easy. Oh. Who the hell is it? Oh, Brand's therapist. Brand's therapist. Okay. All right, so where's the gold paint? I literally just had it in my hands. Uh, do you see the gold paint anywhere? Oh, yeah, it's right here in front of my face. Huh. All righty, let's get this open. Um, Hey, Pam. Hi, Iris. Okay, let's get this going. All right, now, you guys, womp womp. I thought I had three of the same size dowels. I do not. That's a sad truth. But we're going to make the best of it, okay, you guys? So we're going to use... Um, here's this. I need another color tray. We're going to just paint our dowels. Um... Even though they're different sizes, it's okay. Even though two are the same size and one is not, it's okay. Okay. Boop, 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 boop. One, two, three. All right, so here we go. Mm The apple pie one art. Yes, I have. I have it. I believe I still have it upstairs. It's pretty good. It's not a favorite, but it's pretty good. I have to, I'm going to have to come back to painting the tip of that because it feels weird. This gold paint, it's a little thick. And I'm afraid I'm honestly going to wind up getting it. Um, Kind of all over.
<clears throat> okay. This gold, guys, is very pretty. Sorry. I know I'm like, I'm trying to hurry up and paint, and if I concentrate, I can get done quicker, so I'm being very quiet. <laughs> um, hi, Brenda. Oh, is this okay. where I need to be talking? Then? Yes, you talk. Oh. I'm trying Don't to. It's like, also, talk. because of the light, You're I'm... Nice. I know. I'm sorry. It's like I'm hard. I'm trying to see it also in the light. It's a little hard to see it because um, of how bright the light is. It's like literally have to concentrate. Oh yeah, turn the turn the that thing. It's a little air can air thingy. Turn that on. The power is right there. What'd she say? She says hi, Jess. We are in PA already. We'll see you tonight. Yay! I'll see you soon, Pam. Yay. Pam's gonna meet us at the place for. Um, she's gonna go. They're gonna go grab some food. Has she ever been to Couture Tours or Leadership? No, I mean, not that I know of. Not Ch Ch Chacon, I mean. No, no. Okay, where am I turning on? Oh, it's to go right behind you. That tower oh, thing, okay. the middle button yep. has power, and you make sure it's all the way to the top. That way it, like, it makes sure it's on the, the highest thing. It is, I can tell by the way it sounds. I just put it up. So. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Um. Brenda goes, hi, beautiful. Oh, hello. Kat, I wish you were there. T I wish you were going tonight. I know. She says, I'm a little jealous. Kat, we'll be thinking of you. Where's Kat live? Uh, Kat is Connecticut, is it, Kat? Oh. Well, Kat, just jump in your car and start driving now. Oh, yeah. It's that easy. <laughs> Don't jump on any airplanes, trust me. Took me all day to get here. It really yesterday. did. Oh my god, it was crazy. <laughs> Literally crazy. Okay, look at this, you guys. This color is gorgeous. Woohoo for second interview, cat. That's awesome. Okay. That's got a second interview tomorrow. Hey cat. We're getting all the hard stuff done, you guys. The painting is going to be the hard stuff. Painting is always the most, the hardest and tedious. It is. Part. It's the most tedious. You're absolutely right. But it makes everything, oh, it makes it so oh, much yeah. nicer when you do it. Oh, I love it. Love. I'm trying to make sure I got it all covered too as I go along here. Because, like I said, with my light on, it makes it super hard to see, hard to see it, exactly. Okay. I think I got it all. Pretty sure I do. Okay, so we're gonna leave that gold there because we are gonna come back to that. All right, let's put these guys off to the side. Uh, ooh, eh, we're gonna go this way, I think. Okay, keep that over there. Oh, now. No, cat. Yeah, we'll, I'll pray. Hi, Teresa Jackson. How are you? Um, thank you, Connie. All right, let me get this off my fingers again. I guess I threw away that white. That's fine. I don't need to get off. Okay, let's come to our cute little reindeer. Okay, we're going to start with him. Uh, I need my wax. Remember, these are our chalkable shapes. We always want to wax them. Okay. We are going to clean our desk real quick because I don't want to get anything stained, you guys. Nothing stained. Even though the shimmer gold would look pretty, I'm not trying to mix it on here just yet. We're not ready for it. Okay, let's get this dried. Okay, here we go. All right, so there's that. Oh, I already had one. All righty, let's get our little thing of wax here. And we're gonna come in and we are gonna get our wax pulled all over our cute little deer here. Oh, and I'm gonna get my glue gun turned on now. Where's the bathroom? Over here. Okay. Go around that way, it's right there. Oh, right there. Yeah. 
silly. Yeah, the door has to stay open after you're done, so that way the air comes down here. The little bit of air that does. Again, old house. I feel like I'm constantly explaining to Tanya, like, I'm sorry, my house is old. Okay. It's old and hot. Even though we have central air, it's old and hot. <laughs> Now, here is the key to what I've learned with using our doing our chalkable shapes. You don't want to heat the wax on these. You just want to make sure your wax is buffed in really well, okay? Because when you heat the wax up on these, it will make your, your chalking... Oh my gosh, I literally am covered in a layer of wax on my nail here, you guys. Hold on. Um... Hey, Pam, I did not. I only did the one side because I'm, you're not going to, I don't think the way I'm going to do this, you're going to see the other side of the deer. Um, he's just a little distressed is all. He's fine. He's okay. Um, and how's my sign coming? Let's get this wax too while we're at it. Okay. Make sure this is all dry because I do have another project on the bottom that I don't want messed up. I can't even lift this up, you guys. Oh my gosh. Oh. All right. Okay, let's get this one waxed. We most definitely want to wax this because we painted this surface. And it is a boutique surface. Kind of our boutique surfaces, I'm learning. If you wax them, everything chalks so much better. Okay, that's that's what I'm learning, friends. And I just dig a really crisp chalked design, if I'm being honest. Okay, hey Denise on YouTube. Hopefully I didn't miss anybody else on YouTube. If I didn't say hello to you, please know it wasn't intentionally. It's because I've had my head down and I can only see your comments if I look up at my switcher. Okay, so let's get started. Now we're gonna go to, oh, I got so much wax in my hands. Now we're gonna go over to our reindeer games transfer, you guys. And we're gonna do this in three sections, okay? So first things first, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna get our transfer out. And we're going to label the back. I still label the back even though it is two different colors because I oftentimes have multiple transfers out at once. So I do like to have my transfer labeled. Okay, so this is called Reindeer Games. And I did learn that if you use a, a label on the back, it makes it much easier to write on. Okay, there's a little tip for you. So let's get my fuzzy, I mean, fudge. Sorry, I almost said a bad word. Um, I'm like, I just got the dog hair off this towel and I go and drop it on the ground. Of course I do. All right, so let's go ahead and fuzz him real good. Isn't it such a pretty color? It really is. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. We are gonna chalk, we're gonna do our sign first. And remember I said we're doing a whole scene so we're going to have two signs and three deer. Okay. Do one more part of this. Okay. So we're going to do the bottom portion of this. I'm actually moving these guys up here because I don't trust that it's not going to get stuck. We are going to do... Oops. trying to see where I want this to go. I think I want to do hold on, I'm going to have to move the whole sign because it's already stuck. Okay, so it is too big to do with the little detailed swirly, so I'm going to start it right about hold on. 
I'm actually going to just use, I'm going to be smart and use the edge of the surface. Oops, you guys can't even see. Hold on. <laughs> okay, so I use the edge of the surface and the edge of my transfer to line up to see where I'm going to have it go. And I'm just going to push it down to just make sure I have no air bubbles in my silk screen area. Don't push like crazy, you guys, because if you do, you could risk pulling up your chalk paste. And we don't want that to happen. Oh, thank you. Let's put those out of the way. Thank you, thank you. That way it doesn't stick to the glass or anything. Yeah, there we go. All right, so can we see? Yes, we can see. All right, so we've got that. I'm going to do shimmer gold, which I just flipping had. Here it is. Here it is, my shimmer gold. I'm going to do the shimmer gold on this, on the cherry. Oh, I think it's going to look so pretty. Um, that's my cool hope, idea, at least. Pam. Okay. So let's see how this looks. Pam said she bought a second reindeer transfer just to be able to cut, cut it. Yep. That's why I got that six pack. You guys, that no, was she bought the second transfer just to cut. Oh, the to cut it. Oh, that was really smart. Okay, so let's do. I'm gonna do this whole thing in shimmer gold. Did I already just mess up? I did not. Okay, I just have to be, guys. You know I am messy, and I don't pay attention to anything. So I'm trying to for real pay attention to this. Oh, this is gonna look gorgeous. Way too much chalk paste on as per usual a little chalk paste goes a long way friends you do not need much i see my glue dripping i was like where is that coming from up here then i realized yep i know <laughs> it's dripping right onto your phone too oh shoot okay hold on oh my gosh it sure is look yeah. at that <laughs> oh my goodness hold on you guys we're having a glue situation oh my god <laughs> Oh, guys, it literally dripped all over the front of my... Okay, well, you know what? We're going to have to wait on that. Okay, we're going to have to move that. Thank you, ma'am. Okay, mm -hmm. we're going to go ahead and let's peel and reveal this. Oopsie, I, I did push a little too hard on my cherry. Look, it did peel up some of the cherry a little bit. But you know what? It's okay because I told you I wanted it to be a little distressed as long as we can read what it says. And hold on, I realized because of the lighting... You guys may not see it crisp, but you can see it if I put it up like this. It is very hard to see with the light. Hold on. Now, hopefully, you see it a little better. Oh, yeah. I'm trying to get it where there's not a glare because I can see it great. All right, let's try this. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Is it good now? Mm -hmm. All right, cool. You can yeah. hear it. Um, Put it, uh, let me have that over here. Because that's dripping all over. Yeah. That's fine. If it goes okay. on a glass, it's okay. okay. I'll put it on this side. Yes, it does, Cap. Yep. The distressing is going to be awesome because we're not even done with the distressing. We're really going to distress some more in a little while. I got to turn the light back on, though, you guys, because I'm my old eyes are making it hard for me to see. Hi, I'm Tammy. Blind. I am blind. Seriously. And I knew I pushed a little too hard. I should have watched it, but it's okay. Like I said, it's good. Oh, I love it. Okay. Let's pop this over here. We're going to just get this out of the way. We'll come back and do all the distressing together at the end. Okay. Let's move on to our first reindeer. Okay, that reindeer really needs to be fuzzed. He is not going to get fuzzed up. Where's my fuzzing tail? Oh, thank you. Boop. Ah! I did not distress. I don't think I distressed the reindeer, so now make sure we distress him. 
we most definitely do not want to pull up the color on our pretty reindeer. Put the reindeer down and then you can put that right on and so it doesn't stick to the glass of the and stretch the transfer. feel like with him it's going to be lining up the antlers first and if you can get the antlers lined up you should be golden just don't push oops he went a little too far back it just I would say don't push too hard because if you push too hard you might be a little too sad I think that's just the way the shimmer is Connie um it doesn't it's not gonna it's not ruining your transfer by any means so oh yeah no she just said uh the shimmer color she seems to get a little shimmer flakes on the transfer back. oh yeah it's okay that's all right why did i totally like push this all around like hello i should have just adjusted the reindeer instead of adjusting the transfer what was i thinking <laughs> because guess what it's like I can't I it's so here you know what I can't do it on the fuzzing towel you can't. I don't I okay. usually use the um I usually use the backer um can I steal that backer back yeah thank you ma'am um hey Frenchie Frenchie I miss you sweet girl There it is. Oh, get off. Sometimes, you guys, it does take just a second. But once you get it, it's golden. There he is. Look how good he looks. Okay. Now, I did push a little hard, but you know what? It's fine. Okay. So now we're going to come in. And this, we're going to attempt to get every inch of the excess chalk paste off this because I do want to be able to pick up and move and replace it back down because I want to get my second reindeer done okay just so you guys know and I've got a bubble I can see it from here I'm trying to do very very light amounts of paste on this but not so light that I get it dried up on the and on in the transfer because you know sometimes if you just go too light it just literally gets stuck I don't want that I just want to do just enough oops hold on because little legs There's a bump there. Okay, so you got that. Let's get his little. Um, why was I gonna say igloo? Antlers. Let's get his little antlers done. I want to be careful because I am not doing shimmer gold for reindeer up there. We're doing a different color there. Okay. Does it look like we've got it all covered? I feel like it does. Let's get that excess off. Excess off. Okay, let's peel it off now, guys. We'll go nice and easy. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. <gasps> oh my god, you guys. Look how stunning that is. Look how stunning those two colors are. Oh, I love it. Okay, hold on. We gotta put one over here. Let's get our second one under. And guys, when you make sure that you get all the excess off. I promise you it makes for adding, like being able to see through to make sure that you've got it in the right spot. 
Oh, that looks perfect, actually. Like all over again. There it goes. See, he's on perfectly because I was able to see right on through because I got that all that excess chalk paste off. If you don't get that excess chalk paste off, you guys, is not good. Guys, this is going to be like a two-hour live. Oh, my goodness. I'm so sorry, friends. If you need to dip off, you can come on back. I will post the finished project pick when I have it staged at Couture Tour tonight. Oh, I'm so excited to get this project going, you guys. You have no idea. It's going to be so amazing. And have you guys seen our awesome trees? Our new round trees that we've got? Oh my gosh, I have such big ideas for them. I can't wait to play with them. Just got a few orders of them in too. Oh, he's a baby. He's the Eddie boys. He is. Paw right on the ball. Yep. Oh, yeah. He likes to sleep with his toys. Little babies. He's like, they're not taking this for me while I'm sleeping. He's so silly. Again, I'm just making sure I don't go into any of my letters because I'm not doing reindeer games in shimmer gold. That's going to be a different color. Okay, I think I got it all. I'm pretty sure I got it all. We'll find out. Let's see. I'm going to take my time peeling it back. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Perfect. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I'm getting so excited. You know when sometimes things just come together the, the way you hoped? And sometimes even better, that's where we're at right now. Hi, Shelly. Let's see. Oh, these look so good. Okay, so here's reindeer one. Here's reindeer two. Okay, and we've got our sign down below. Oh, that's going to wind up burning me because I was stupid and didn't pay attention to that. Oh, I hate it. Get off of me. Maybe it's a good thing they can't see your face right now. I know. Oh, there it is. Okay. All right. I should be doing filming behind the scenes for your team. <laughs> you should. Oh, no. How did I mess him up? Okay. It's okay. I put my finger in him or my bracelet. One or the other. That's okay. I took a picture of you and posted it on the team. Oh, my God. Hopefully, I wasn't making a crazy face. You're pretty good at getting them. Okay, so we've got these. Hi, Amanda. How are you? All right, you guys. So we've got our two deer going. We've got our one sign done. Now let's get our next sign done while this dries. I did mess him up a little bit, and it's fine. It's not a big deal. I'm not worried. You shouldn't be either. Okay? It just helps our distressing. So let's put these down. Now, we are gonna do, and we are not painting this sign. What did I do with the sign? Ouch, it's on my dang toe. Now, we are going to do our white arch base. I forgot to look to make sure this one was in stock. Is the white arch base in stock? Please tell me it is. Because if it isn't, I gotta quick change my mind. Um, darn it. I know, but I feel... I know, but once in a while, they already know you're doing it for the thing tonight. So. Yeah, you guys, I'm hopeful that this is in stock because I am trying to do this for the couture tour. I'm looking right now. Yes, please be in stock. If it's not, I can let you know. Maybe it'll be back in stock very soon. Hi, Tara. How are you? It's so good to see you. And you guys, for all of my friends who are on here, it I... Is on, in stock. 
Thank goodness. I know a lot of you guys were, were my customers and I had an issue during the month of August where my site was down the entire month. And you guys, if you did go in and ordered, you may have been cookie to a new designer. I would love it if you would go and click on my website right now and please make sure that you re-cookie yourself to my website. So that way you become, my, you know, I become your designer again. Um, because what may have happened was you may have gone to a new designer and may not have even realized it. So I would love to have you back as my customer. Yay, thanks, Star. Thanks, guys. I like totally forgot to look before I um, did this. Okay, so here is what I would like to do. Oh no, tell me this is not, Ooh, it is. Okay, I had to pull this down. That's what it was. North Pole Reindeer. So I'm gonna do, I'm gonna have to lift up and put down a few times because I wanna make this fit onto here. And, oh guys, wait a second, hold on, this may not fit now. I thought this was gonna fit. <sighs> hold on, we might have to do a quick shuffle. We are gonna do a quick shuffle, hold on. Hold on friends. We are gonna use instead Let's me think about these. Oi. Let me think how I can do this. You know what? So guess what? If the reindeer is a little cut off, I really don't care. That's okay. I just want to make sure that I can get the deer at the top again. That's all that matters to me because I would like to be able to do my reindeer and then do reindeer games at the bottom. So if I can do that. Okay, let's see if this is going to fit. So we got to keep in mind, I'll just adjust for the games. I'll just slide it over a scotch or you know what? Again, we're fine. If I have to do it like this, so be it. It's just that S. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna I'm gonna pull it over like this. I'm gonna do games on here, and then I am going to readjust. Are you guys even seeing this? Why does it look crooked? Oh, I promise you it isn't. I think it's my my thing because this is the way I wanted it to be. I feel like. Get off my table. Hold on, you guys. It looks crooked to you, but I promise you it's straight on my end. Sorry. I have to do it this way because I'm, I'm throwing my own self off, and I'm trying to make sure that this goes on straight. Okay, so this looks good. Okay, so we're gonna do games there. And I forgot that I need to wax the surface. <gasps> okay, that's fine. Um, let's do this in. I'm trying to think of, I wanna add a pop of color to this, guys. So what color should we add? I feel like we should do, should we do, this charges slower than the losses over here. Is it? Oh, I'm sorry. It's okay. Let's think what pop of color we want to add to this. Do you think I can go upstairs now? I think so. Yeah, it should be fine. Okay. I totally think it's fine. Or you could try. There's um. There should be a charger over here. That's fine. I have some better ones. Um. Guys, what color should we add? Help me out. Tell me what color you think we should add as, a, add as a pop of color. Should we do... Like a blue. Like a blue? Like How about blue. like Shimmer Moonlight? Yeah, 
Yeah, like a like a a, a Christmas night blue. Okay, so like Shimmer Moonlight, you think? Yeah. Because Shimmer Moonlight, we can get in the, isn't it called the Gems, is it called the Gemstones pack? What's that called? I think so. It is called the You're a Gem, I think, pack. What's that called? You're a Gem. And I am 98% sure that is Shimmer Moonlight. Yep, that's what we're going to do. I feel like that will be super good. Or green. Okay, we could do green. Want to do, should we do Forest. Because forest is in, um, forest is in the, whatchamacallit, is in the, uh, bleh, can't talk, in the you're a gem. Or should we do that? Yeah, we could do that. Why don't we do that then? Should we go with that? I feel like we should. Let's see if this is gonna, um, let's see if how this is gonna look. Hopefully... I am not going to make this bleed. Actually, you know what? I'm not even going to take the chance, you guys. Your best bet is to just always wax our boutique surfaces. Leanne said green, too. Okay, you know what? We're going to go green then, you guys. We're going to go green. And why should we not, right? I'm going to wax this surface. Just because I feel like I've learned with our boutique surfaces, if you wax them... Things come out so much nicer. They really, really, really do. And I'm just feeling like this is an a entry. This is an entryway project and an entry into an art contest. So why not, right? Why not? I can wax. I feel like I waxed it all. Okay, we should be good. Lord knows I've got enough wax on my nails. Holy Hannah. All right, so let's go back to what we were doing. So, we have it mush pulled up. I like it right there. I think I'm happy with it. And you know what? We could, we really honestly could just do the whole thing right there, just like that. Or I can seriously just move it over just a scotch. And you know what? If it runs off, it runs off. You know what? I think I'm okay with that. Hey, Janine. Because the problem that I'm having is this opening. That's not going to be here. So it looks a little, it's going to look a little weird. But that, you know what? It's okay. We're going to see how it looks. And guess what? That's the best part about Chalk Couture, you guys. If I don't like it, I can take it off. All right. So let's get our... We're going to do reindeer games in the forest. And then the North Pole and the doily thingies are going to be in the um, cherry. Okay? How's that sound? Hi, Cher. Hey, Janine. Okay. All right. So let's go with this. Let's go forth and do what I was saying I wanted to do. It's We're not taking it back now. We're going with it. It is what it is. Just trying to literally take my time so I don't mess this up, you guys, because we all know I normally don't take my time, and then I'm sad when things don't turn out the way I want them to. 
if I would just take my time for a minute and see right there, I, I went into the little doily part and that's okay. I can see that this is going to dry out. Oh, that looks great. That looks awesome. Okay. So we've got Reindeer Games. Hi, Dolly. Hey, Denise. How are you? All right, guys. I'm just going to lift up the games part now as well to let it dry. Oh, it's looking great. Okay. So I just literally pulled it out of the silk screen. Now I just want to push the rest of this down so I can come in and do the rest of this in the cherry. I'm trying to be super careful. So I don't spread the forest into anything else, okay? So let's get the cherry. I love forest too. You guys, I hope we're able to see this. I really do. I hope you're able to see what I'm doing. <gasps> sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay. Let's make sure this is working correctly. I think this is gonna look so pretty. Oh, oh, I pulled a little forest in it and I didn't mean to. It's because I'm rushing, because I feel bad I'm keeping you guys on for so long with this project. And we still didn't do the one piece yet. You guys, we still didn't glue everything together. Oh my gosh. It literally is the worst. Literally, I am the worst, you guys. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull this one little doily piece down, this little detailed piece to add it into where there's the opening for the antler because I don't want the antler, obviously, to show. Like, I, I don't want that to be like a big opening. Like, it just isn't going to make sense, you know? So see that? Like, I feel like I want to continue that line. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to pick this up and move it across. And I'm going to bring a little doily piece over. So hold on. Let's watch what we do here. Watch this. Look how good that looks. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> you guys, I'm so happy with this so far. Hey, Florence. How are you? Just watch how good this is going to end up looking, you guys. Just stare, stay with me. Just stick with me. Now, here's a little bit of an issue. I just went and used... Now, when you wax, what we've learned is that you should not... Um, boy, hold on. So you see this little, this little piece right here? This is what I want to add in. I'm going to add it right there. So I'm going to try to line this up as best I can. 
without smearing stuff. Oops, nope, hold on, oopsie. Please say I'm not smearing anything. So hopefully this is gonna line up perfectly. Can you guys see what I did? I lined up this line and this line and this line and this line, and I'm gonna move this candy apple over and hopefully it looks good. We're gonna see. I might have to add a little snowflake up in there or something. Maybe a little shimmer gold. Maybe that's how we'll combine the colors. Because it's not centered. And that's okay. Okay. Oh, that looks so good. And you know what? We are. We're going to add some. We're going to add some stuff into here. We're going to add maybe some snowflakes or something. I think that will be so good. Oh, that's great. You see how good that's turning out? Oh my gosh. What do you guys think so far? Are you guys with me? Everybody's so quiet. And we're going to add one more reindeer up here. I should put one more reindeer, 3D reindeer up here maybe. What do you guys think? Oh my God, it looks so good. Actually, I'm not going to add the 3D reindeer because it'll make it tip. We're not making it 3D. We're not going to do that. Come on and dry, little friend, because you know what's going to happen? Where's my shimmer gold? Um, what's going to happen is I'm going to go to paint chalk and it's going to bleed because I've got the, uh, the wet, uh, piece or the wet, uh, the wet, um, wax. Do you guys love it? Oh, I'm so glad. Thanks, Danielle. All right. And this is how we're going to tie our colors together. We're going to put these three snowflakes right there it was like it was made for this they were made for that spot you guys look at it one two three uh where's my hopefully i don't think there's anything else that i could go over with this big squeegee i think we're okay here cute little visual triangle please be careful jess oh perfection you guys what do we think all right now we just got to get our we're going to do a gold um deer right at the top and then this sign is going to be down a uh, done rather and then we're going to get our stuffed deer done oh my gosh this looks so freaking good i'm so sorry i did not mean to Say it like that, but it's the darn truth. Okay, hold on. Oh. Hold on, I'm taking, Oink. it's the wax has turned a little green. There we go. Okay, you ready? Now watch this. We're going to put, because I am not trying to just. <sighs> Let's see. Hi, Tony. going to do it like that. Oh, it was wet, you guys. Oh, no. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. One second, you guys. Sorry guys, I just, oh, it's so, it's wet. Ay, ay, ay. And I smeared it. Okay, 
So here's what we're actually gonna do. Our reindeer is gonna be jumping through the bottom of this a little bit, okay? Because it just has to happen that way. We're gonna have him go a little bit. Oh my gosh, guys, I'm, you know why it's, I'm having an issue? Because it's getting stuck on stuff. Hold on. Because I got to adjust for, I got to go like this. Here it goes. And you know what? If some of his antler goes off, I'm okay with that. As long as it's somewhat centered, which I feel like he looks like he's going to be. Okay, I feel like we're good here. All right, and we might have some major distressing happening because I did have some shimmer gold that did dry in the center of some of these pieces, okay? Like at the tail. Guys, I'm trying to make sure that I'm not pushing my fingers into anything or that I'm getting the shimmer gold into any spots I don't want it to be. Okay. Trying to see if I can work my way through some of the spots that are super distressed looking. Like here and here. There it goes. Oops, his tail. I knew that was going to happen on the tail, though. It's okay. All right, you guys, what do we think about that? How do we think that looks? That's good, right? Are we good with this? All right, I gotta put this somewhere. Hold on. Let's put this like this for right now. Because I'll come back to that. Okay. I feel like that looks adorable. Okay, let's get them dried. Oh my gosh, it's two o'clock already. Guys, I feel like I'm taking forever. Ooh, I'm so sorry. All right, I gotta find some Q-tips. Um, right here, I've got Q-tips so I can clean up where North Pole bled a little bit because I was a dope. Hi, Missy, how are you? Oh my gosh. I'm literally getting my stuff everywhere. Rebecca. Hey, Missy. How are you?
All right. I think I'm very happy with how this turned out. I definitely think I am. And I will come in and do a little distressing onto this because we don't want it to be just all bright white here. We are going to distress this up a little bit to match our, oh yeah. Oh gosh, it looks so good. Okay. It's going to be good. Now let's come in. Whew, moving right along, friends. Moving right along. Let's get to our... Um, let's get to our stuffed deer. Okay. Who was the, who was here, Bran? Oh, it was Dan Hunter. Oh, what was happening? Ron? What was happening? No, we were just talking about something. Oh, okay. I thought you were going to do Okay. Oh, shoot. Yeah. You guys, I think I put the wrong lid on something here. I did. That was supposed to be sure that was supposed to be my green. Hi, Karen. Here's my shimmer gold. Okay, let's get these over here. Let's get this back. Now, you guys, let's get one more color tray to get my um things in. I'm gonna put this up here. Let's get our canvas. Let me make sure I have no color on my hands so I'm not destroying it. Right? My Glue gun is steadily dropping glue all over. Okay. Steadily dropping glue all over the place. All right. Where's my canvas? Here it is. Now I got to find where I drew it. Here it is. So I am going to... Just honestly, for ease, because this piece is so big. Ooh, what? Oh, what? Did you forget? I thought you were downstairs. I didn't hear somebody up there. Oh, my gosh. Okay. 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 Just for ease, I'm pulling this apart. I normally would not because I wouldn't want to waste any of it. Oh, you got all freaked out. I got a star. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> Just keeping you on your toes. Okay. So, here is my cute little deer, you guys. And I know he's a little hard to see, but I can see him just fine in here. So, I'm going to come in and I'm going to fussy cut him. Okay. And all I did was do a little bit of excess... Uh, a little extra outside of my surface. So I use my chalk shape to trace. And I am trying my best to see. I kind of wish I would have used a black chalk marker now. However, this is still just fine. Because I think I did him backwards, so it's not like I'm going to have problems with it anyway. It's smelling amazing up there. Oh, thanks. Oh, wait, you guys, I'm a dope. I needed two of these. That's okay. You know what we're going to do? We're going to lay it down on top of another piece, and I will cut it. I should have been cutting. It, it's smelling amazing, you said? Yes. Mm. I'm glad to hear that. I'm not hungry, but yet that smells amazing. <laughs> Still got a few more hours. Yeah. I would say you can have some if there's any left, but by the time we get home, those boys will have torn that apart. Oh, they, I don't need any. I'm sure they I'm are finished. crazy about beef stew, but they may not be super crazy about this one because it's not my homemade one. I actually took the lazy way out. Ooh. I know. I'm a bad mom. Mm. Bad mom. What a package yeah, my deal. My boys haven't eaten the rest of the pot roast then when I get home I'm putting it into a beef stew. Oh there you go. I told them that they could go out a couple nights but they needed to make sure all the leftovers were cleared out. They smart. Smart smart because you know guys you were probably not seeing me fussy cut this but it is very light on this fabric so I've got to hold it as close as I can to myself so I apologize you're not getting to see the full piece of this. And um, 
Full disclosure, you should have put this together with another piece to make it easier on you. So that way you had two pieces. I forgot to do that. Womp womp. So I made it harder on myself. So what I'm going to have to do is actually cut another piece. So I'm just going to lay this piece down that I have and I'll just cut around it. Like I'll probably just glue it. I'll get it started to glue onto another piece and I'll just cut it from there because we're going to have a stuffed cute deer. And honestly, if you have, because there's an, is this one an SVG, Tanya? Can you yes. remind me? No. It's not? It's just the shape? I'm pretty sure it's just the shape because we have the shapes. So we wouldn't get the... Va no, that's not true. We do have the shapes and SVGs of some things. Okay. I will look and see. Because um, there's a few of them. We have both. I just can't remember. Is it in the catalog? Uh, yes. I was, like, I was almost like, no lies. <laughs> uh, oh, it smells so good as I'm cutting it. The, the Reindeer Games itself is a digital download. Yep. Okay, so there we go. So what you guys could do is, if you have a cutting file, or a cutting machine rather, and you purchase the digital file for this, you could make your life easier and do the SVG, ouch, I just stubbed my toe, um, and cut it on, cut your your canvas, your distressed canvas, like use the, one of the thick mats that Cricut has for like fabric, and you could, um, have this cut out on your burlap so you don't have to fussy cut it and I was going to show you guys that but time time you guys I don't have the time to do that we're just gonna quick cut it instead and like I said I realize you may not be seeing me cut this but I have to my old eyes I can't see what I'm doing friends I just can't see what I'm doing so it is what it is okay so there is the bottom part of my deer, and now I gotta come in and do his antlers here. Let me come in. Still on doing the front part. Oh, this is gonna be so stinking cute. And it smells so good. You guys, it really does. A little bit of extra work, but guess what? It is worth it in the long run. I'm telling you, this whole scene is gonna be so good. Like I said, I would have taken at least two days to do this. I am rushing it for the sake of doing my tour tour project and I am trying to see where the hay I traced this to and they're like is this going up here I think it is I don't want like that. And this is going to come in further. I have this is going to come in a little bit rounder. Okay. There it goes. 
here is my deer cutout. Whoops, there's that. Look at that cute little deer. You see him? He looks so good, you guys. It does have a digital file. That's right. Hi, Linda. How are you? Linda Hill Long and Linda Holt. How are you guys? All right, now I'm going to grab. I'm saving hey, these Linda pieces. Hall. I am going to grab my other piece that I was telling you guys about, and I am going to start gluing him down. And we're going to stuff as we glue. Now, let me show you guys what we're going to use. Oh gosh, oh gosh, I bet he was up right now, he would be crying because I'm knocking everything over and he hates when I do that. He's like, mommy, you scare me. Okay, we're gonna use some polyfill. Oh, good. You don't care what you're doing. Thanks, Janine. I know, right? He's like, whatever, mom. I forgot who you are. I somebody's attention, I don't care. Exactly, he doesn't <laughs> care at all. Okay, let's see, what's the right way? Okay, so that's the backwards way. This is the correct way. So here's the way that we're going to do it. Okay. And I'm going to just go ahead and get started. I am going to start gluing up at the top. And again, I'm going to just four E's of myself here. I'm going to just cut a piece again. This is the longest video you've done. I know. I know. I think I'm going to be going on almost two hours. Oh my What's God. That? It's going to be a little over two hours. <laughs> but it's a big project. Oh, yeah. You know? That's a lot. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. I hope you're sticking with me and nobody's bored. Are you guys at least entertained? Are we at least entertained? I hope we are. Okay. Let's get finally the glue gun. It's been sitting here ready for forever. Leaking over everything. Exactly. <laughs> Leaking over the world. Okay. Let me move this stuff out of the way so I can sit for a little bit here to do this because my eyes are hurting trying to like scrunch and look at everything. Okay. Here's this. Here's this. I have my stuff that I still got to add to things. Okay. All righty. Where's my polyfill? There it is. All righty. So let's start. We're going to use... A mix of our multi-tool, and I love this little pokey tool in our artist tool set. Okay, you guys? So let's go ahead and let's get started by doing the um, tips of the, what is this called? The, uh, bleh, I can't think, antlers. Turn it over. His antlers going. Glue it down. Look there. Oh. You don't. Is that what you're wearing tonight? Yeah. Yes, ma'am. Ah! Stay. Okay. Make sure I have enough room. And I glue it down. Because once it's down, it's down. And you're going to push out, you guys. Push out, not in. Because if you push it in, your glue is going to go in and you won't be able to stuff it. Hey, Sylvia. Okay. So now from this part, I'm just going to go around the edge here of the antlers. I want to get the antler part done. Once I have the antler part done, then I will start the stuffing. I could get the there it goes. I was like, if I could get the glue over to there, that would be awesome. And all I did was just go a little bit extra around <laughs> the chalk shape. What? Nothing. You just said all I did was go a little bit extra. Well, oh. Extra, <laughs> Sadly, I am. I don't mean to be. I promise. Mm -hmm. It just happens. Not in a bad way, by no means. I don't take. I don't consider it that way. Oh, I know plenty of people that would. Plenty of people that take me being well, a little extra, a bad way. 
they don't know you. This is true. So. This is very true. Okay. Oh, this is coming out. Guys, I all I can say to you right now is I wish there was smell of vision This cinnamon smell is heaven to me. Remember, we're just getting around the antlers done. And once we have the antlers done, then I'm going to go in and start the stuffing. And you're going to go as close to the edge as you possibly can, you guys. Okay. And remember, you want to pull out, pull towards the edge, not the inside. Okay. Uh-oh. Are we coming too close to the edge? Oh, no, I did good. Yay! I'm just there. Oh, thank you, God. Okay. Great, great, great. Okay. All righty, Rue. Oh, I got my finger stuck, of course. What time will someone be here? Four. Uh, three, no, no, between 3.30 and 3.45. So we can okay. go for four. Okay. All righty. So we have the antlers glued down. Okay, I don't know if you guys are able to see that, but the antlers are glued down. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a little bit of my polyfill. And actually, you know what I think I might do? Yeah, no. I'm going to get a little bit of my polyfill, and I'm going to get started on filling that up. Okay? Just a little bit. You do not want to overstuff whatever you do. If you overstuff, you're going to pop it, and it's not going to stay glued down. And then you're going to be sad. Is it so, dry already? Oh, yeah. It's, oh. it's drying. You're on quick. And I'm trying to go into the area up here first. This little tool from our artist tool set is like perfect for stuffing where you want it to go. If it's not, like if it's like not moving how you want it to, get your detail tool and stuff it in where you want it to go, okay? So like now I wanna turn a little bit and get some stuffing up into this corner. See up in here? Up into this little antler. And I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I probably should have stuffed that little antler first because this is the furthest corner. Silly, silly me. Oh, I popped it, I popped the seam. And you know what, I'm gonna use that to my advantage. I'm going to use it to help push it up in here a little easier. Just a little bit easier. Because I should have done this as I was coming around. I forgot how detailed his antlers are. All popped it, but no big deal. Oh, look how good he's looking. Hey, Nat. Ooh. Natalie. Second, I thought she said a hey, nat. Oh no, nat. I'm like, what? <laughs> <laughs> I say I don't even think he has Facebook, does he? Yeah, he does. Oh. He's just not. He stalks his wife. Oh. He doesn't comment or anything. Or ever say anything to me, but he'll stalk me. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Creeper. <laughs> Creeper. Okay, so we got our little antler here all stuffed up. I'm gonna go ahead and re-glue this part down. Okay. Re-glue this little part right on down. Oh, it's hot. Yikes, that's crazy hot. Holy cow. 
Okay. Now. Oh, wait. Is he backwards? There it is. Okay. I was like, wait a second. Let's go on over into this part and we'll go into the down part of the other. Um, we're going to go over down here into this part of his, uh, hi Cindy, into this part of his uh, antler over here because this is the next for this part back. Okay. I, I t probably went a little too, um, too far with the gluing of the antlers, you guys. And I know you're probably not seeing all of this. I'm trying my best. It's that I just got to have to do it where it's close to me, where I can see it all. You understand, I'm sure. I want to make sure I get enough of his little antlers tucked up so that way they actually poke out, you know, not poke open. But like, so that way they're like, oh, you could tell they're stuffed. Okay, so I popped this seam too. Big surprise. Did I? Oh, maybe not. Maybe I didn't pop it. Maybe it's okay. Maybe it's fine. There we go. Okay, let me just, I may have just missed this little area to glue. That's all. Oh, it's hot. Hot glue, hot glue. Okay. Typically is. Yeah, for reals. <laughs> for reals. Okay. So we got him. He's going to be so cute. Like I said, it's a little bit of work here, you guys, but it is going to be so worth it once it's all done. We all love our little stuffies, right? Ah! Oh, I forgot. It was that national test. It must yes. be 220. Yes, it is. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh. I warned you about it so that... I thought it was said tomorrow. No, I said today. Oh, you did say today, huh? My bad. My gosh. It's just a test, friends. It's just a test. Did everybody just go crazy for one second? <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> you guys, if you could have seen how high I just jumped. <laughs> <sighs> oh, my goodness. Literally. That's funny. I ah, it's happening again. Yeah, but it's going off on all my things. Okay, yes. calm down. Calm down. There it goes. <laughs> my gosh. Is Eddie okay? Is he even moving? He, no, I told you he's fine. Okay. Oh, my gosh. I'm here right by him. Huh. Oh, my God. It's all my all my things. Is it interrupting your body? I hope it's not. Okay, calm down. Okay, hopefully... Hopefully you guys are still, I'm able to still see. So hopefully you guys are still able to see too. Downstairs, so. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <sighs> that wasn't crazy or anything. But see, if I had told you, you would have been freaking out right now. Correct. <laughs> Correct. Okay. Oy, oy, oy. All righty. Oh, goodness. Now, Bran is calling me while I'm live. Hold on, guys. Still live. I'll call you back. I did. It went off while I was live. Yes, I love you. I got to go. <sighs> He's like, aren't you aware of that thing going off? Yeah. <laughs> I'm aware, man. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay. Is he worried about it? I don't know. Does he not know? I don't know. Hey, Joyce. How are you? All righty, guys. Let's keep on going. What? Oh, I'm just laughing at you. Hey, no Tammy. How are you? Okay, you guys. Woo. Tammy who? Um, Tammy G. Oh. I don't know how to say Tammy's last name. Mm -hmm. I don't want to butcher it. All right, you guys. We're going to move right along, and we are going to seal up this one side and one side only. Okay, I'm trying to see where I need to glue right here, and this is a little difficult. You're not going to show them the final, um, how it's all put together. Until right? it's, until I'm at Couture okay. Tour. I told them I went. Sure. Yeah. So you'll have to tune back. I'll show them. I will post a picture. Oh, shoot. I will likely go live is what I will probably do. Oh, my gosh. So much for having my nails done today. Hey, Roberta. They Roberta. look Roberta Icer. Mm -hmm. 
My last name is not pronounced anyway. It's spelled G Ohm. G Ohm. Did I say it right? Did I say did I say it or pronounce it correctly, Tammy? I don't want to. I don't want to butcher it. I'm so worried I'm going to say it incorrectly. Tammy had such a great reel the other day. I'm pretty sure it was Tammy's reel. I think it was Tammy who gave such a great tip. I loved it. Okay, let's see. You guys, I'm shaking from the um, thing going off. Oh, literally scared the... Oh. Ohm, think of home. Oh, Geom. Okay, got it. Geom. Love it. Thanks, Tammy. Okay. You guys, we literally are in the home stretch of this guy. I promise. I, I told you he was gonna be a little a little bit of work, but he's worth it. Yay, the Velcro bow. Yes, it's such a good tip. Okay, okay, let's start stuffing a little bit at a time here now, you guys. This is where we're going to do. I did a little, t I glued a little too far down on the last part um, for our antlers. So now we're not going to go as far. Now we're going to stop and we're going to do a little bit of stuffing for his head. Oh my gosh, he's looking so good. I'm so pumped. I know you guys may not be able to see it yet. I promise you, he is coming together so good and wait till we we cut him again like because like i said it would have been so much easier if you <laughs> if we would have cut both pieces at the same time but i didn't have the room on my desk because of all the other projects we're doing good job tammy way to go see you guys that's the kind of things we do on my team page we do fun challenges okay let's get this little head going up his little neck and head. Get it stuffed. Because we don't want the head caving in. So we need to make sure that he is fully stuffed here. Because <laughs> he's got to support himself because he's going to be up in the air. I'm going to have him popped up. Popped up, popped up. I love that you're just laughing at everything I say. You're so funny. Okay. Uh, you should see it, see it when I'm watching you from home. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, I'm actually talking to the screen when you're asking questions. I'm like, oh, da, 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 da. oh she, she can't she hear me. She can't hear me. <laughs> she can't hear what I'm saying. If I'm busy doing something, I'll have an earbud in watch, uh, and listening while I'm doing stuff. And then you'll be like, oh, is this still in here? And I'm like, I'm like, yep, sure. Shoot. Nope. Can't. Somebody nope. else will answer. <laughs> that is a great idea, Leanne. And maybe it's going to happen. You may have already thought of something I was going to do on this guy to give him a pop of color. Okay, all righty. I'm just giving it a second to make sure it's all dry right here before I start popping in some more of this area because we're going to really get this go. I'm trying, guys, I'm trying to go as quick as I can because you know what? I think there's like a three hour time limit with a uh, switcher, oh, and goodness. literally, it's crazy how long I've been live already. I can't believe I'm still live at two hours. I got to be done by two and a half hours. It's just, I'm getting myself stressed out thinking about it, but I'm telling you, it's going to be so worth it. Ouch, it's so hot. Oh, so hot. Okay. Let's get this rounded and then we're going to go and stuff some more. Rounded. Okay, now we're going to get some more stuffing done. Actually, you know what? I wonder if I should... You know what? Let's seal down this leg. I'm probably going to regret saying that, but I feel like maybe this is a good call. I don't know. We're going to see. You guys are going to learn from my mistakes. Let me make the mistakes first, 
and then you learn from them. Okay? Okay. <laughs> oh, I love that, Leanne. Always have Rudolph on your mind. Oh my God, that's so hot. Huh? Okay. Wee, yikes. All right. Now, I feel like even still, that is such a wide opening. Such a wide berth. That sounds terrible to say it that way, but it is the truth when I say this. So I'm going to have to seal even more up because there's so much room. Like it's such an, a big area. We got to go like this. We're going to have to seal up this spot. And then, hi, Michelle. And then we're going to have to seal up this spot. So that way I can just stuff, stuff, stuff and put his little pole in. Oopsie, why did I do Michelle it like B. that? Michelle. Michelle K. I definitely don't want to do too far over here because I want to be able to stuff down that leg. Okay, I think we've got a good amount here ready to start stuffing now. Uh, let's start stuffing up in here. Actually, you know what? Let's do down here first. Okay, ready? Put my finger down in there. What? Oh, okay, I didn't know you went anywhere. It's your favorite cartoon. It's a great cartoon. It's a great Christmas cartoon. It really is. Okay. Fun. Hi, Heather. Fun fact. Which, uh, which Rudolph is, is her favorite? Which Rudolph is your favorite? You know you can sit in the massage chair if you want. I'm good. Okay. Which Rudolph is your favorite, Leanne? Ouch. Heather's on. Hi, Diana. I'm not tired. My eyes just feel very heavy. It it's might not be because you flew all dang day yesterday, could it? Oh, no, not at all. I have anything to do with that? Yeah. It's not like I was piloting the plane. I mean, I guess not. <laughs> Planes. Yeah, right. Oops, I need more polyfill. Reach down and get it. Oh, okay. 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 Hi, Iris. I am making a stuffed deer. It is the cute little deer from the reindeer games, and I'm gonna have a whole. I'm doing a whole scene, honestly. <laughs> you say stuffed deer, and I think of uh, like a deer head. I, no, the oh. like the venison roast that I cook up. <laughs> oh, well, there you go. You take a roast, and you could do this with any type of roast, but you take a roast and you butterfly it out and pound, pound it out so it's flat, uh -huh. and then you take uh, cream cheese and regular cheese and like green onions, mm -hmm. and if you like jalapeno peppers, you could do that, and then some seasoning, and then you mix that all together, put it in the, uh, in the roast, layer it on and then you roll it up and then you tie it and wrap it with bacon oh my gosh it is amazing um it sounds like it would be i cook so <laughs> i do just not like that <laughs> i'm so good diana how have you been my friends hope you're doing well okay you guys we are right at the end of this guy before we seal him up, I know it took forever. I'm sorry it took so long to get there, but he's worth it. We need to put our stick in, okay? Now, I know, I said it that way. Yes, I did, I know. All right, before we do that, I think what I wanna do is I wanna, ow, I wanna cut him. I'm gonna seal him up just a little bit more, okay? He doesn't get home till like 310, 3.15, well, more like 3.15. Thanks, Joyce. You're so sweet. Okay, hold on. Okay, let me seal up the rest of this leg. 
Okay. Oy. I'm gonna try to make sure I get it down enough. Ah, oh, that's super hot. And he is crazy hot. Yikes, yikes, yikes. <laughs> oh, I'm going to have no fingerprints left, you guys. I promise. There's going to be, like, nothing. Okay. Oh, yeah, my nails will, should be okay. All right. While I've got this like this. <laughs> Here's a bunch of fingerprints. Just I know. Nails. I know. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to cut him out now, okay, you guys? I got it glued enough to where I can see where the backer is. And we're going to go ahead and glue it. Now, keep in mind, do as I say, not as I do. Cut the two pieces together once you trace it. I was not even thinking, and I honestly should have just stopped right then and there and, and started cutting at least the one part. But I was like, oh, I could cut it all together. No, dummy. I should have just done it all at the same time. Because that's how you would normally make a stuffy. Yeah. Think of how you make stuffies is how you're going to do this. Except it's going to be up in the air, okay? It's the only difference with this one. And especially because of all the twists and turns um, of the antlers, you definitely want to cut, cut all at once, you guys. Because I'm going to lose the fine details of this, which is a bummer. Because I chose to cut, I chose to do it this way. It's not going to be as detailed, I think, now. I can't even tell what the heck I'm cutting, to be honest with you. Oh, yes, I can. Here's his nose, which is where we're going to put a little red pom-pom piece. It's going to be so cute. I'm just trying to make sure that my scissors don't cut so far ahead that I cut into my stuffed pieces. And I know, I'm sorry, you guys are not seeing me do this part, but just imagine I'm cutting. Just imagine I'm cutting. Imagine she's sticking her tongue out cutting. I am. I do. I, I literally, you guys, I concentrate by putting my tongue out. I do too. I literally concentrate that way. Doesn't that mean something? That you're concentrating really hard? No. Like those that stick their tongue out when they're doing something versus, I don't know. I don't know. I never heard that. If that's something. Hi, Linda. Hi, Diana. Oh. oh my gosh, you guys, I'm trying so hard <laughs> to get around the pieces so that way I don't have such a huge piece that I'm working with. It will make my life so much easier once I can get rid of some of this. Oh my gosh, okay. And now I can just take it into little bite-sized pieces. Oh my goodness, I love this. It's going to be so good. Okay, I can't see where the heck I'm going to right here. Again, I lost my fine details because I don't have sharp enough. And I refuse to use my transfer trimmers part, the transfer trimmer ones on these. These are my scissors, so I'm just going to go with that. Oh, but it's going to be so good. It really is. I promise. Okay, we are getting a body, friends. We're getting a body. <laughs> Look. Oh, he's getting so cute. Oh, my gosh. Okay, let's finish out the antlers now. I'm starting to be able to see it. See his antlers. Um, so that way I can get these cut out. Because there's such a big area here where, like, his little antlers went. Again, I gotta get down to a smaller section and then I can come in and fussy cut a little bit more. Oh my gosh, he's so dang cute. Oh my goodness, I can't take it. 
literally. Oh my gosh. Hey, Judy. Hi, Deborah Brown. I'm trying not to like cut, cut his little head off, you guys. I'm trying really hard not to do that. Oh my gosh. Look how good he's coming along. Loving this. Oh my goodness. I'm going to be covered in burlap. <laughs> Seriously. Oh my gosh. Look at him. Look at my little deer. Okay, you guys, now let's finish up the bottom part so I can cut that part. We can get them all finished and stuffed. Oh my goodness. Okay, wait, you know what we could do? Oops, I forgot around here. Hold on. Let's get this little edge done. And come over here and get this little edge done. keep only about that much so that way I have room to like glue it down okay <laughs> oh my gosh he looks so good so digging this okay oh my goodness thank you Sylvia hi Casey okay you ready all right let's finish him up now, what we have to determine is, oh yeah, here's the thing. We're gonna go straight up through here because I'm gonna need to have something to keep his head up and part of his antler up. So we're gonna go like this, you guys. Do you see that? See how the antler stayed up? So that is where we are gluing him. It has been made a uh, official um, what is that called? An official, I made the official oh, decision, executive decision. There it is. Executive decision has been made. Okay. And I've got to flip it over onto this side to get the glue on because this is the side where I know it's going to need to be glued. Come on, glue. I need you to work for me. Okay. I'll need you to work for mama. Ooh, yikes. Sorry about that, friends. I may have pushed that down a little too hard. <laughs> I... Oh my gosh, I'm sticking to everything again. Where is my multi-tool? Leave it to me to mess this up right at the very end. Are you kidding me? No, you're not messing it up. I did. No, you didn't. I think I did. Oh, you know what? I didn't because that's right. I still, that's the part I still have to cut. That's why I was like, oh, I did. But I did not. Because I flipped it over and I couldn't see what I was doing. Oh, no. Ah! No. Hold on. Hold on, you guys. Okay, hold on. We're gonna do this. Let's 
Sorry, I have to pull this away. I cannot mess this up right at the very end, my friends. You cannot allow that to occur. We just can't. Oh, that's so hot. Why, thank you. <laughs> it's just so hot. Put, popping a little extra glue right at the dowel because I don't want anything to happen to that. Okay. Ouch. Hold on. Literally, I'm really seriously burning my fingers here. Okay. Now, before I continue on, I want to get this extra these extra pieces cut off that I do not need. Okay. That needs to come off. And then I need to scoop this piece off. Oh, I was just cutting into the drill, the dowel, it's not just. Okay. So here is our super cute deer. What do you think? Cute. Isn't he adorable? Okay, now we can decorate it. We need to do our little nose. What's, how are we running on time? Oh my God, okay. So, hi Carrie. Thank you, Tammy. All right, we're gonna just check up and make sure that he is glued in everywhere. I'm gonna give another pop of glue right here to ensure that I am sealing it in good. Okay, we're sealed. We are got, we're gonna get um, our little, um, we're gonna get the, out. Oh, oh my gosh, that hurt. We're gonna pull our, put our poly seal stuff away so that way I have room for the other things. Okay, hold on. Um, Okay. Ouch. And I know. You're just like my my puppies. You make people tired when they lay by you. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> oh, you mean Eddie or me? No, Eddie. Oh, I thought you were saying me. I was like, well, that's nice. No, Thanks. I said Eddie. Oh. I said puppy. Puppy, puppy. Okay, so the thing is, is the. I thought I was gonna have a. I thought I had a little pom pom, and I don't. But I've got this. And I thought this was bigger in my brain when I thought of doing this. It is not. So you know what we're going to do? We are going to do... I know what I have. I know what I have instead. We are going to use... It's over here. Oi. I should have... I do. Yeah. It's not as bright as I want it to be, but it's still a little... It's going to be good for the vintage -y feel. Nah, it's too big. Okay. Too, too big. It's okay. This is good. This was what I was originally thinking, but I knew the color of it. But it's all right. It's fine. It's going to work. It's going to work. People are going to get what it is. <laughs> okay. I know, Deb. I know. I wish they were too. It's hard. Okay, so here is our cute little Rudolph. Okay, he's precious. And he's going to fit right inside our little spool that we made, right? So we made the spool. And we still have to distress this up, friends. And how are we going to do that, you ask? Oh, you know, just one of my favorite things that we use right now. And that's going to be some salmon. And we are going to do, um, we're going to use some, we're going to do some Mod Podge maybe on it, I think. Or, you know what, we may do some, We might do some Gorilla Glue. And you know what else we're gonna do with this? We're gonna come in with a little bit of the gold. And we're gonna... Hi, Mary Ann. We're gonna just feather weather some shimmer gold onto this to distress it a little bit. 
Okay, see how it looks. Hi, Cindy, how are you? Get all these going, and then, you guys, wait to see what else we're gonna do. But we're gonna do the shimmer on first. Not heavy, not heavy handing it at all. I'm literally plopping it on just enough. Oh my God, the closed caption said salmon. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh. It's my accent, I think, which is so funny. Okay, I am going to, to, hold on, let's dry this up. I think it's okay, actually. Oops, that's not what we want. Oh, I'm going to be going through a whole slew of color trays today just because, you know what, you guys? I'm just not in the mood to be doing a huge cleanup. Let's be real. And I'm going to see if I can control this. I'm going to test a little fairy here. Let's get a little baby brush. Let's get a little baby, little baby thin brush here. Actually, you know what? We can st we can use the brush I was just using. Where's the gold one? Do I need? To oh no, 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 because I might need to do a little bit more gold. On I'm, I am going to do some more gold on some things. That is not going to work. Okay. And that is not going to work either. Okay. So here's what we're going to do. We are going to spray into a paper towel because I am not trying to have glue all over the place at all. I know. You know what, guys? I think I am going to do the Mod Podge. I don't want to do the spray. It's just, it's going to be a mess. It's going to be a mess. So we're going to Mod Podge. We're going to get some Mod Podge. Ugh! Yeah, a little bit of Mod Podge. And we're going to just drip drop it on some spots. Now, with Mod Podge, I'm getting a foam brush. We do not want to use one of our good brushes. Okay. Hey, Kim. Let me just Steal out one of these guys. Oh my gosh, look. <gasps> Gross. No, don't fall in there. Let me be able to rip you off. Gross. That's like a giant thing of Mod Podge. Okay, so I'm just gonna randomly push it around. And that way, it, the glitter, the the um, cinnamon doesn't go all over this. Okay, so I literally just pick pick, pick spots, and we're just gonna run the glitter all, or the the glitter. I keep saying it. The cinnamon sneaking while working. I get it, girl. You do what you got to do, my friend. Okay, so we're gonna come in. We're gonna go a little heavy-handed with it at first and we'll shake it off. It's not a big problem. Okay, we'll shake off what we don't end up using. And this is not um, cinnamon that my family eats, just so we know. Okay. This is not the cinnamon that my family will eat. Okay, do you see how good that looks? Oh, it looks awesome! Okay, that is one. Again, I'm gonna come in. I'm just gonna randomly add chunks of the Mod Podge. So that way it'll pick up some spots for the cinnamon. Put that over there. And I will probably use a spray sealer on this once I'm done. I will have to go do this outside. You guys will get to see it minus the spray sealer. Okay? Because I cannot do the spray sealer indoors um, for big brand gets migraines, I get migraines, and we have Eddie. Um, so I don't want to do that. Oh my gosh, freaking perfect. Look at that. What do you guys think? 
Nobody's saying anything. Are we not liking it? I'm afraid that you guys don't like it. I am digging it. And whatever um, Mod Podge that doesn't get used, you guys, I will put this back into my jar here. Just seeing. I mean, whatever uh, cinnamon, rather. That's why I'm using a, um, whatchamacallit. That's why I'm using the, uh, you love it? Oh, good. Good, 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 you guys. Good, good, good. I'm so glad. And thanks for sticking with me for so long. I know it's a longer video, but... I think it's going to be perfect. Just watching, Casey. Yay! All right. Now, let's come in, and we're going to add a little bit more to Rudolph here. Just a little bit more. Did I finish his leg? I did. Okay. We're going to add just a little bit more, okay? Even though he smells amazing as is, he really does. really smells good. I'm just going to add a little bit more. Oh, shoot. I brushed a little too hard there. Sorry. Um, where is that brush I was going to use? This. Oh, I did a little too hard here, too. Hold on. Come here. Go a little bit more. like going everywhere but where I wanted to go on the Mod Podge. <laughs> okay. He looks fantastic. My little Rudolph. Ah, Janine, I get it. Totally get it. Okay. So let's start. We got our, we got him. We got him. Let's add a little bit to our other deer now, you guys. We'll add a little bit to them, right? Now, the cinnamon we're going to just try to do a little coat, a little bit. We're, it, sadly, the cinnamon, I don't know that we're really going to pick up all that much because of the color. Okay. Um, I'm going to try. I'm just going to randomly, like I said, I'm just there's no rhyme or reason. Just thin, thin stripes will go. Okay, um, where's this? Oops, I'm, doing, I'm really going crazy town with this cinnamon. And it's okay though. It really is. Because cinnamon makes the world better. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness, look at that. You guys see how good he looks? Oh my gosh, look at him. Oh, I love it. Oh, goodness gracious, looks amazing. Okay, I'm gonna go. Oh, shoot, that was a little bit thicker than I thought. Oh, so is that. Just gonna go random lines. Just rando, that's all. Hey, Gina. Oh, I, I got a little heavy handed again with the cinnamon, you guys. Again, I've got it on top of my paper towel so I can just push it right back into my jar. We're not wasting anything. You know, we're crafters, we don't waste stuff. God, he looks 
Amazing. Look at that. Oh my gosh. You guys, these both look so freaking good. Oh my gosh, I can't take it. Okay, so we've got that, we've got that. Oh, now we gotta do our other signs, our two other signs. I'm trying to remember everything that, oh my God, I'm getting cinnamon everywhere. Okay, we gotta do this one now. I feel like this is gonna be, like I'm probably not gonna, I think I'm gonna not do, I may not do cinnamon on this one. Hold on, friends. I literally am running out of room. Okay, we're running out of room. Hold on. <laughs> Do you see the mess I've also created? This is a good time. This is a good day, you guys. We're doing it. We're having a lot of fun. I think because I may, who knows, I may not, I may not keep this chalkboard in the future. I might want to redo something on it. We're going to see. But we are going to distress it with distress ink. Okay. I can hit it with a little bit of cinnamon, I feel like. Oops. I hate this, the sponge dauber look, friends. So we gotta rub that out real well. Hey, Debbie. think about that we looked at that nice distressed look just a little bit of a distressed dauber maybe we should add oh if I do Mod Podge on here though it definitely will stay on my board so you know what we're gonna just leave well enough alone and we're gonna let it be I feel like that's gonna be good enough okay and I think Mm, yeah, I think we're good here, too. We might just add a little distressing onto this. Like this. Hey, Tammy Curtis. How you guys doing? Can you even see this on here? I don't think you can. But you know where you can see it at. On my board. You know what we can do? Ah, I got a better idea. I need, I know what I said I was going to do with this. Where's my shimmer gold? What did I do with the pastes? Here they are. We are going to, where is a board eraser? I need a portion of a board eraser. Literally, you guys, I don't have any free space on my station. None. <laughs> oh my God. I have a board eraser. Hold on. I know where it's at. It fell. Oh my gosh. Literally have made a giganticized nest. A gigundicized owl. Come here, eraser. Okay. Whew. There it is. I don't need this whole big thing. We're going to take a portion of it. And we are going to get some. Oops. Hmm, not turning out the way I wanted it. Actually, yes it is. I'm not going to go overboard with it. There it goes. It is literally just enough. And I don't even know. Again, it's really hard to see this board with this lighting here, you guys. It was literally just enough. Can you see it even at all? 
just enough. Okay, so we've got that surface done, this surface done. We've got, okay, let's start mounting these guys. And while we're at it, we are also going to finish, we're going to get it mounted into their little, little homes. Ow, I'm going to step on my Aiden board that just fell over. Come on, Santa, stay up. We're going to get these put into their little homes. Okay. Now, our little deer, I want to make sure I, I glue them all the same way. So, I feel like a glue piece needs to go like this. Ow. Literally sitting on my finger. Oh! Ah! Okay. Oh my gosh. Get it off. Oh, I have to do it like this so that we don't see it. Okay, that's okay. So I will do it. I will just quick adjust. One, two, sorry, I'm just quickly adjusting friends for where I had to re-glue. Okay, just readjusting, okay. Let's just give it one sec to just glue on down. I don't want it to be seen. Oops, stay there. Stay. Stay on down, little glue guy. Yes, Tammy. I am going to Couture Tours. This is actually my project for Couture Tours, which we leave in 55 minutes, you guys. This is almost a three-hour live. It took me almost three hours to make this whole project. Are you kidding me? This is insane. This is insane. Oh, my gosh, you guys. It's precious. Oops, hold on. It is coming unglued. Please hold. It is coming unglued as we speak. I probably should have glued a little bit down by his leg as well. So let's do that a little bit. Okay. Oh, oh, are we rolling off? I feel like we are. It's going to be seen. We don't want it to be seen right here right a little messy sorry you guys my back is a little messy here because I didn't want it to be seen I will sand off this glue that we can see right there and I will take care of all my little glue daubs Thanks, Connie. Oh, Casey, okay, so you guys are so great to me. Thanks, guys. I still have to add the ribbons and stuff. I'm almost done. Guys, literally 10 more minutes and I'll be finished. I'm just, unfortunately, my glue is taking nine years to dry. Okay, that one is done. Ah! And we almost knocked him over. For the love of Pete, this one is dry. And what has to happen with this guy is I have to glue him in. So I have to, I'm going to have to hold him. I, I got to do him last because I don't have the time to be holding him. Nobody's got the time to hold you, little deer. Where's my, where's my polyfill bag? Oh my God. Okay, I don't have time to find that either. Where's my third deer? There he is. Okay. All right. Oh, that's easy enough to see. Oh my gosh, don't fall over. Hold on. This is the spot. I feel like this is the start of the gluing. Probably should not be doing this unless I can, you know, actually see.
Oh my gosh. Okay. So we got spot one started with the uh, gluing. So this is how I'm doing it now, just to make sure that they're all going the same way. I make sure, I wanna make sure it's hidden behind here, right? So I'm gonna spot some glue. I know you guys are not seeing this, but I'm putting the glue right there. I have to make sure that I'm doing this the correct way, so I need to see this in front of my eyes. Sammy, pop my glue. Okay, you know, messy crafter that I am. I'm not gonna do a crap ton of glue. All right, is that wet still? Okay, it's not wet. Let's put him down to dry a little. Okay, we're gonna just keep that glue a drying. And while I'm waiting here, um, oh my gosh, you guys, I cannot believe this mess that I made. Ooh! All right, we got this. Okay. Let's go and get, all right, so we're going to do, oh my goodness, I have such a mess. We're going to get some Jingle Bells. These are going to be so cute. Do two, three, four. Now we're gonna do just one on each one, I think. Or should we maybe just do one? Hmm, we're gonna see. We're gonna see how it stands up. I'm a little afraid I'm gonna, hopefully this guy appears to be done now. Okay. Oh, that could be the hubby. Okay. He is in, but he wants to fall. Why do you want to fall? little holder. Did I not lay you down right? Why are you staying up if you're not wanting to stay up? Is it because I need to turn you more? What the hey? Does he need to go down for a Oi. Okay, it's okay. Hi, Nancy. All right, we're going to get, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to, when I add something, it'll be fine. Okay. Now for this little guy, we're going to make him be. We're going to get him. We're going to do him right about there. Let's see if this works the way I plan to glue him in. Hopefully it does. My hope is this will work. Or it'll just push all the glue out. That's awesome. That, that could work too. So there's that. Okay, let's hope he stays ultimately. You guys may not be seeing this, but all I'm doing is just adding him to glue. You know what I bet will help make him stay up? I got an idea. I got an idea. Got an idea, friends. I got an idea. Okay. Hopefully he's staying. Okay. Let's do this idea that I have. I think if I tie the cute little jingle bells onto the bottom... Um, it will help weigh out the base. So we're going to test that theory, you guys. We're going to test the theory on him. And then let me pull some twine over. Let's see. Ooh, stay. We're going to do... Oh, where's my cute running gold stuff? And I've got this. I don't know. I'm going to be able to use all of this. I really wanted to use this ribbon 
I know you guys aren't seeing the full thing, so hold tight. Just give me a second. I'll move it around. If not, we are adding, we're making a bow out of this somehow for the one. I feel like we're going to do it on this one. Okay, that's fine. Um, let's add this and this onto this guy. A little bit of rickrack here. Around his neck, because it's going to be so cute. bell hoping it does not make him fall over we will see okay I think I can finally move him now and he's not gonna fall over I think we're good hopefully his glue is set I'm trying <laughs> hopefully it's set friends we'll see huh my finger's stuck in it. I have glue everywhere. Okay. Everywhere. And now I'm getting cinnamon all over my shirt. So that's fun. I was supposed to be changed already for couture tour. I might have to rechange now. Oh my gosh. This is freaking precious. Should his bell go this way though? Where should his bell go? Should it go behind him we think? Should the bell go behind him? I feel like it would, right? What do we think? You guys, bell behind? I think you know what's going to have to happen. I'm going to have to put the bell on a piece of twine. What do we think, you guys? Are we going to put... Should we put the bell behind? I feel like the bell should go behind. Nobody is answering, though. Where's the twine? What did I do with it? I cut a big piece of twine and I stuck it right here. Before I tie the little bow, I need this behind. Okay, cool. Thanks, Deb. I appreciate your input, my friend. Should I do two bells on him or one? I feel like if I do two, it might be a little too top heavy. Exactly, that's what I was thinking. Whatever balances him best for the spool. He stands up just fine. So. Yikes, yikes! We're having a, we're having a tipping contest. <laughs> Perfecto. You guys, everything I touch, I'm sticking to. I literally can't stop sticking to stuff. I can't even tie the bow. Oh, where is Tanya? Tanya, please come down and help me. I'm sticking to everything. Oh. There it goes. We're going to just go with him that like that. Okay, he is precious. Oh my gosh, you guys, hold on. Look how flipping cute he is. Our little spool. Okay, he is adorable. And we're going to add, I think I'm going to add a little bit of other ribbon down at the bottom to help ensure, well, A, to um, hide our glue. You know, because I have glue down there. I think I like this ribbon. Mm, no, I think it needs to be a bigger. How about this? How about this? this? Seems like a magical type of ribbon. Oh yeah, and you know what? I could probably do it around all of them. Let me come back here. I think I'm going to do it like this. Just to hide a little bit of that glue. Okay. 
So we've got him done. Complete. Get out of the way, friend. And he fell. It's fine. All right, let's move on to this guy. Got to figure him out. Why do you want to fall? Um, we got to add, we're going to add some jingle bells to the bottom of them to help with making him stay up. Stay that way. I think we're going to add some jingle bells to the bottom of him. We got this, you guys. And I think to tie in the burlap, I think I will add, or the canvas, um, whatchamacallits, what are they called? Ugh, can't talk. The, uh, the uh, tie in our little canvas, um, dude. I feel like, you know what? No, we're gonna do just one bell, it's too much. I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna tie in some pieces of this because I think that'll make it fun. We can do some shredded pieces. Ooh, I think it's gonna be good. Oh, this is gonna be awesome. Okay, we got one piece of that. We'll tie in a piece of this, of course, as well. doing enough for both um, of our dudes. One, 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 one. I'm trying to make enough for both you guys right now. One. One. We're going to tie in the other ribbon as well. Again, we're going to pull it all together because this is how we're going to make it all work. Right? Red and red. Stuffy dude. Our little stuffy dude. He's so cute. Do I not have any more of that red ribbon? Oi. For reals? All right, so you know what? We're going to add in. We're going to make some red and green in this guy to tie in our green. And so these dudes. You like that? These dudes. That's what we're gonna do here. This has got red and green and gold. Hi, yeah, yeah, you guys. Longest live of my life. I have two minutes before I think I get shut down from Switcher, so I gotta bust a move. Okay, this and this. So let's go ahead and let's see if this theory pans out. That if I tie my bell on, just stay up, would you, little guy? You're not helping. Am I even making a knot? He's top heavy that side, so I gotta make him go this side with the bell. Come on, little bell. Help a girl out, would ya? And then we gotta add our little ribbon. Please don't fall again. I can't afford for you to keep on falling. You're like literally messing my game flow up here, little guy. make a messy bow out of this. We'll do this in half. Oh, this is going to be good. One and two and three. Whoops, one, two, three. One. Where'd it go? Two, three. tied on with the bell. Oh my gosh. Hopefully this does it. Hopefully it will. Come on, little bell. Know your role. There it goes. Please stay up now. Yes! Look at me go! Okay. Let's go 
them up here. Holy stinking cow, he's so cute. Oh, I love him. Okay, let's trim him up a little bit. So the bell is what did it. Well, it did do it until I went and spoke too soon. I make sure he stays down. Okay, so that's number two. Get number three done. Are we at three hours? Holy cow. Okay, and I didn't get shut off. That's great. Okay. Let's get this little guy together. You guys, thanks for sticking with me for so long. Do I have anybody? Oh, I still have people on. That's awesome. I did not expect that, to be completely honest. Really did not expect anybody to still be on. Okay. <sighs> All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, my gosh. Hold on. Tie on the bow, the bell. And then I messed up my whole little messy bow here. Hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six. Get my little bell on. Oh my God, you guys cannot see what I'm doing. Jesus. I know, we're still here. You guys can't stop now. You can't, you can't not continue to watch, right? Please say you stay up. You do? Oh my God. Okay, it's precious. Here we go. He's done. Uh, I will go live from Couture Tour tonight. Yes, I sure will. Most definitely. All right, now we're going to get reindeer games. You guys, this is going to be a little hard for me to show you what I'm going to do. I, I honestly don't know. Um, I know that I need to get the lid on my Mod Podge is all I know and get this in the trash. Um, let's see. Um, let's go with, oh, I know. I want to tie in this fun bow, this fun ribbon somehow. And I'm going to get some of the burlap, I think, that's left. Hey, Debbie Birmingham. How are you doing, my friend? I have been live for three hours. I'm trying to finish my couture tour project and I leave in 20 minutes for couture tour and I have to go refix myself because I am a mess because I'm a messy crafter. <laughs> okay. Okay. One, two. Nope. I keep doing this. One. We're going to go one, two. We're gonna do Mirando pieces of the burlap in here. I'm gonna just make it a little bit more appropriately messy. One, two, eight, one, two, three, four, farts. Do I not have any more of the burlap? That is the best piece I have. Okay, that's fine. Four, five, six. Oh, Tanya seeing Bran upstairs. I hear that. Okay, let's get another little piece of twine up in here. Oh my gosh, yeah, no, that is not long enough. Oh, but you know what it is? Oh, this that I can use. I should be using a zip tie, to be honest with you guys, but I'm going to tie it together with this. And we'll figure out. You heard Tammy um, say what she used is a... Uh, oh, this actually pulled it together nicely. I sure will, Sylvia. We'll be sneak. We'll be. Go I'll go live, and I will sneak peeks most definitely. Um, 
I will be doing all of the things that I am allowed to do. Best believe. Um, I think we're going to go like this. I think we're going to quick dovetail this. I mean, crap, I've used up so much time in this live. It's not even funny. I might as well push the limit if I can, right? One, two, you guys, tell me what I should do. Um, should a, be, there be a bow or no bow? Oh my gosh, for the uh, for the um, for the last one. Tell me, should I tie in this fun ribbon that's getting fur everywhere, or no? What do we think? Because I've got to make this decision quick. Literally, I'm. <laughs> We're going to be late to couture tours if I don't um, bust a move. Oh my gosh, this is so fun, you guys. This bow. Seriously, it's like so fun and wintry. I just need to pull this out a little bit. It's like, it's fine. Where should we even put it? I'm not even sure where I want to put this little guy. Should we put him? You know what I should have done? That bow we're keeping for the other thing. I've got an idea. Hold on. We're tying a little bell. <laughs> I got an idea. We're going to do another bell. I wonder if I can make it look like, I wonder if I can somehow, if I could just somehow add it on to make it look, no, that's right. I can't do that. Okay. Guys, I don't know what I'm going to do. No bow. I agree. Okay. We're going to do no bow on this guy because it is more than enough. And then this one, we're going to do a bow. Okay. How about this one? Oh yeah. We're going to do it right here. We're going to put this one just like that because this one needs it. Is this coming undone? It is. Okay. okay. Ah, yes, the bell. You like the bell idea? Okay. We'll see if it'll stand up. I'm worried it's not going to stand. This one is going to be so cute with the bow right there, though. I really didn't want to glue a bow onto here, but you know what? We're taking it for the team, friends. We are taking it for the team. Hopefully that's centered. I did not even look. I just glued. Oh, this is, I'm so happy with how this project turned out, you guys. I really, really am. Oh, yeah. Yes, and I, you know what I need to do? Add a bell right into there. Bam, we're going to add a bell right into there. So the bell is our theme, carrying our theme all together, the bells. Boop. Oh gosh, is that Trish here? Oh my gosh, we're, I'm gonna be late. Okay, you guys, oh, look at that. Oh my gosh, okay, so that's done. Ow, I just stubbed my toe and my foot fell asleep from the way I was standing. Okay, so we're gonna quick, we're gonna add a bell with a foam dot, you guys, because I am, I'm not going to ruin this board. That's why I didn't even add the cinnamon. So we're going to add some foam. Hopefully it'll stay. Hopefully. Oh, thanks, Connie. Literally, sometimes it's hot mess. That's what you get. <laughs> That's what we get. I do really feel like it needs to have... I'm going to tie a bow through it like this. A little bow.
All right, you guys. Uh oh. Ah, I'm going to wind up pulling it off. Okay. Please say it'll stay up with this on it. And it will. All right, I'm going to bring my foam dots because I am not trying to not have this little guy on here. Oh, that's not a bad idea. Or, you know what? Why don't I do some clear tape? How about some clear tape and glue it onto the clear tape? I've got clear. This, yeah, packaging tape. How about that? That's a great idea. Thank you for that fun tip. Let's do that. Okay. Okay, that's what we're going with, you guys. We are going to go with a piece of packing tape. do just a little piece okay literally the tiniest piece ever okay ready Hey, babe. I know I'm just about done. Literally just did like the biggest project ever. Okay. You guys, here it goes. It's done. I did all of them. Okay. Let me show. Oh, oh no. The packaging tape even came off. What happened? Oh no, friends. That did not work. The packaging tape came off. Why did it come off? Why did the tape not stay? Okay, hold on, it's plenty sticky. Oh my gosh. All right, so you know what we're gonna do? What I do with the dang tape. We're gonna do this. Ay, ay, ay. Can a girl get the, this job finished? I feel like I'm not gonna be able to. Ready? Let's try this. So not what I want to do. I'm about to just glue it to the board. Guess what, you guys? It's going to happen. I'm taking one for the team. I can get... It's not like this surface is retiring. All right, Mom, we're going to do our... Tell Daddy to just come say hello to me real quick. Okay. Tell him I'm just about done. Hopefully, this is the spot that I want it because this is where it's going. I sure will. Don't you worry. I'll probably go live at Couture Tours too tonight, you guys. I probably will. Don't fall, little bell. Okay. We got it now. All right, you guys. Three hours and 15 minutes. But it was so worth it. There's reindeer games. We have reindeer games. And, we ha and he stays up. We've got takeoffs, flying, landings. Oh, so cute. And then we've got our three deer. Here's our two cutout deer. Our cute little deer with our cute little bells. And they are standing up. Well, one is so far. The other is. And here is. This sweet little guy. He needs one more thing at the bottom, you guys. He needs one more little trim. So I will have, you guys, I will get all of my, um, what is it? I'll have the cart link for in here later on. Okay, let me shut my glue gun off so I don't burn my house down. I'll have the cart link in here for later. I will um, be live, okay? I'll post the finished project pic so you can all see. And that's all she wrote, my friends. Um, 
I hope you enjoyed creating with me. I'm just adding one more little piece of trim because he looks a little bare since he only has the one color ribbon down on him. There it goes. I just wanted to add another little piece of ribbon to him. Um, so if you have any questions, let me know, but you'll see the finished project pick later with the cart link. I got to go. I'm running late. I will chat with y'all later. Thanks for hanging out with me.